Hi everyone, welcome to Cracking 4th Grade Common Core Math, Week 2. This week, we will be looking at addition and subtraction word problems. The first thing we want to do when we have a word problem, we're going to read our problem. We might have to read it more than once to make sure we understand our problem. Then after reading and understanding our problem, we're going to go ahead and underline the information that we need to solve the problem. And then we're going to identify what we are required to do because that will let us know what operation to perform. So first, we're going to read our problem. Maria took a three-day driving trip. She drove 425 miles the first day, 378 miles the second day, and 539 miles the third day. About how many miles did Maria drive in the three days? So the inf what we need to solve the problem, we need 378 miles, we need 425, and we need 539. What are we going to do with those numbers? Ask ourselves the question, what is the problem asking us to do? It's asking how many miles how many miles and we're going to also look at this word about so how many miles and the how many miles will tell us what operation to perform so how many miles means we're going to add these numbers so let's go ahead and add our numbers 378, 4, 25, 5, 39. How many? That means we, we add. Eight, 8 plus 5, 13. 13 plus 9, 22. Two at the bottom and two up top. Two plus seven, nine, plus two, eleven, plus three, fourteen. Okay, fourteen. So four at the bottom and one up top. 3 plus 1, 4, plus 4, 8, plus 5, 13. So we have added our three numbers and we got 1,342. It is a multiple choice and we look over here and we see our choice is not there. So we go back to our problem and look to see what is the clue that is going to help us to pick one of these choices, to pick the right choice. So this word, about, about is telling us that we are to round this number. And we look at the answers and see that the numbers are rounded to the nearest hundred. So let's go ahead and round this number to the nearest hundred. So the three is the rounding number. The three is a rounding number. So we look at the number after the rounding number. If the number if the digit after the rounded number is less than five, that means we round down. And rounding down means we keep the rounded number. 
So 1,342 rounded to the nearest hundred is 1,300. So we have our correct choice is A. So when we look on our answer, answer sheet, we will color in the choice A. Number two, what is the difference between one hundred and twelve thousand eight hundred forty one and ninety two thousand four hundred eight okay so let's look for our clue words so these are our numbers these are what we need the information we need to solve the problem but what are they asking us to do they're asking us to find the Different. What is the difference? Difference. And this will tell us what operation we need to perform because we know that difference means to subtract. So we're going to go ahead and subtract the smaller number from the larger number. 1, 1, 2, 8, 4, 1. And the two, four, o, oh, eight, and we are subtracting. One take away eight can't, so we'll go to the tens and we borrow one. That means we're gonna cross. We borrow one, that means we cross that one and we are left with three. Now that becomes 11 because the one that we borrow, we break it down into 10 pieces. So now we can subtract 11, take away eight, three. Three take away zero. 3, 8 take away 4, 4, 2 take away 2, 0, and 11 take away 9, 2. So we have 20,433, it's multiple choice. So we look and we see that choice B is our correct choice. Next, Mark drinks 1.09 liters of juice. Richard drinks 0 0.987 liter of juice. How much more liters, how much more juice does Mark drink than Richard? Show your work. So we have been showing our work, so there's no multiple choice here, so we have to show our work in here we didn't have to show our work but we show it anyway but this one we are required to show our work so let's see information we have to work with 1.09 0 0.987 0 and it is asking us what do we need to find how much more how much more how much more so that means we have to subtract so here we're going to subtract the smaller number from the larger number so we have 1.09 and we're subtracting 0 
eight, seven. We can put a zero here as a placeholder. Zero take away seven. We can't. We go to the tens. We borrow one. Okay, let's drop this down a little to give us some space to show our work clearly. So we're gonna drop it one line down. So it's 1.09, take away 0 And we put a zero here as a placeholder. Now we have enough space to show our work clearly. Zero take away seven. We can't. We're gonna go to the, the, the hundredth and we're gonna borrow one. 100 leave head and we're going to put the one right there so it's now we can say 10 take away 7 leaves 3 8 take away 8 0 0 take away 9 we can't so we're going to go to the ones and we're going to borrow leave nothing we bring it over here we go to the ones we borrow one borrow one leaves nothing we we'll bring it over here has 10 and 10 take away 9 one and we line up our point and this is zero so our final answer is zero point one zero three zero point one zero three zero point one zero three and that's it for this week i hope you find this very helpful please like share subscribe and stay tuned for next week video See you.